In this lecture, we will understand about the fundamentals of logic and why it has so much importance in computers and artificial intelligence. Like previous videos, this video is also based on the notes of computer science that I created for appearing in different tests and interviews. Artificial intelligence in general sense is the study of computer systems that model and apply the intelligence of human mind. Now, of course, humans exhibit intelligence in many forms. It can be the ability to learn and apply knowledge and knowledge to manipulate or adapt to environment or ability to comprehend and the ability to reason or have abstract thought. Now, at this stage, AI cannot co cannot copy or show the or, sh or learn all the behaviors of humans. But if AI has to mimic the intelligence of human mind, one thing that artificially intelligent computers have to learn is to reason like the humans do. Now, this is where the logic is important to design the artificially intelligent computers. Because logic is the reasoning or critical thinking to evaluate the validity of a statement. In other words, to prove if something is true or false. For this purpose, computers use Boolean algebra to formulate the logical operations. In Boolean algebra, result of an expression can be either true or either can be either one or zero, which is analogous to logical statement, which can be either one, either true or false. Propositional logic is simplest kind of logic. A proposition is simply a statement which can be either true or false. A factual statement is considered a proposition. In other words, a statement based on facts that can be proved true or false using mathematical rules. A statement which expresses an opinion or question cannot be considered a proposition. Examples of proposition can be sky is blue, 5 plus 7 is equal to 12. Both of these propositions are true. First one is based on fact and second one is mathematically correct. A statement 6 plus 7 is equal to 12 and some and sun sets in the east are false because first one is mathematically incorrect and second is factually wrong. Propositional logic follows the rules of Boolean algebra. Like the logic, Boolean algebra works with two values 1 and 0. Boolean operations that are used to check the validity of logical statement are given here. Most common statements are joined by AND, OR, AND, NOT. Conditionals if then OR implication and if and only if helps help us formulate or validate a decision making statement in a computer we will discuss each one separately along with their respective truth tables proposition which contains a statement connected by a conjunction or and is true when both statements are true if any of the statement is false proposition is false for example a statements parallel parallelogram is geometric figure and circle is geometric figure both are true so we can write the proposition using AND as parallelogram and circle or geometric figures. Table shows objects P and C with different true and false values represented by 1 and 0 and result of AND operation. You can see that when both P and C values are 1, result is 1. In other words, a statement or, or expression is true. Negate any of the statement and proposition becomes false. In this case, the result is 0. In a proposition with disjunction or OR operation, if one or more than one statement is true, proposition will be true. For example, proposition Jake or John live in New York will be true if both or one of them is living in New York. If none of them is living in New York, a statement will be false. In terms of Boolean algeb algebra, if P and Q, P or Q, or both zero, result will be zero. Otherwise, result will be one. Negation in logic is simply a statement that turns a true proposition into a false one. Negation or NOT operator applied to the variable changes the value of variable to 1 if it is 0 and 0 if it is 1. Implication in logic is a relationship between two propositions in which second proposition is logical consequence of the first. Simple implication is also known as if-then proposition. Consider the following statement. If it is sunny, then we will go to the beach. If the sky is clear, then we will be able to see the stars. 
by directional implication or if and only if proposition is true if both of the statements are either false or true for example consider the statement you will be allowed to do this job only if you have completed the course truth table elaborates this concept opposite of if and only if a statement is also important in boolean algebra if we apply not operator to if and only if or by direction directional implication we will get an operation called exclusive or in boolean algebra following truth table and proposition shows the concept if two horses are racing one will win the race not both of them by directional implication is also known as even function whereas exclusive or is also known as odd function up until now we have been talking about propositional logic only which is all about a statement or proposition that can be true or false there is no need of complex math symbols to demonstrate propositional logic unlike propositional logic in which statements describe a specific fact predicate logic statements use symbols mathematical symbols and functions and are true for a range of values predicate logic has two forms first order logic which allows us to easily quantify relationship by simply representing objects and operations with simple math symbols second form is higher order logic which has a strong semantics and more expressive you need to have understanding of the complex math functions and theorems to write higher order logic statements predicate in first order and higher order logic simply shows a relationship among the objects constants or variables in first order logic a statement is not a straight sentence made of words a sentence in first order logic is made of terms and quantifiers terms are composed of constants symbols variables and function symbols propositional logic propositional logic statement it rained on tuesday can be written with the help of predicate weather and we can replace day of the week with variable x so we can write it as weather bracket x comma rain bracket close these are some of the connectors quantifiers constants variables and predicates and functions you can use in first order and higher order logic higher order logic uses additional quantifiers and a stronger semantics using mathematical functions we can quantify not over just objects but we can quantify over relations as well consider the statement two functions are equal if and only if they produce the same value for all arguments you cannot write this statement using propositional logic or rules of the first order logic this statement is a theorem and it involves functions using the symbol f and g for the functions and quantifier for all we can read it as for all f and for all g f is equal to g if and only if for all x f of s f of x is equal to g of x this video is based on my notes uh, mostly created from computer science books you can learn more about logic from different sites or books i'm sure you will find better resources there as well thanks